scenario, people thought I was lying. Because you wanted me to be the bad person. Because your bitch ass and your bitch ass heart, you know that nigga so perfect, you want him to be flawed. I'm not pussy. I have everything. I know it's hard to believe, but I fucking do. And what comes with being this type of nigga is a lot of pressure, niggas. Okay? So you niggas, when y'all had these little feelings toward me, nigga, trust me. You don't want to sit in this seat. You couldn't even handle what comes. Because he a fucker. The nigga damn near perfect, so it make you uptight. I get it, right? But y'all wanted me to be like the bad person. Because that's what your bitch ass heart desired. Who who little heart in the congregation today? Whose little heart was broken by this? Hmm? Whose little heart has found out the devil is a lie like it isn't in the books that we already knew that? Hmm? Anybody want to take it to Jesus? Which one of you bitch niggas who jumped in the in that car with dude? How do you feel now? Wipe your fucking mouth. The nigga whole everything is a lie. He walked in and lied to y'all. He said today, you see, when I when I don't entertain it, how I die down, power moves. Whoa. First off, you didn't you stop entertaining it because I asked you where you was from. And St. Louis was saying you're not from that west side. And then you were entertaining it because I said this cinnamon story don't make sense. That's when you stop entertaining it. See, when when Holla get backed in the corner, he his bitch ass run. He runs. I, I, when pressure comes, when you press him, he back up. He has to come at you. Think about the human. Characteristics never change. He has to be the aggressor to you. He can't even debate with you without raising his voice. When he raises his voice, he wants you to back up from him. I came to the bitch nigga. I came to him. I came to him. I said, hey, yeah, where you from? Where you from, nigga? First question up. Where you from? Simple question. He stopped talking. That nigga ain't said a word with a W in it since that since the West Side nigga starts saying, no, the fuck he's not. No, the fuck. He ain't even used the W. He ain't said what's happening. He ain't said what a burger. He ain't said what a fucking day. He ain't said nothing of the such. Because guess what? See, the niggas don't, you dorks don't matter, man. The truth is the truth. See, I asked my people, I said, hey y'all, where I'm from? No questions. Where dude from? That was on live on Instagram. Where dude from? Man, I don't, that ain't that. If a nigga can walk in a room and tell you he from a place he ain't from, he's an automatic liar. He's automatically a liar, right? Okay, one th- do, do, do any do anybody know any single family liars? No. If you lie once, you're gonna have to keep lying over and over. And over and over again. Okay, in this whole exchange, right? During this whole entire exchange, I'm the first nigga to say, hey man, dude is lying. Bro. This don't even make sense, man. So this smack footage came out, and Smack said he don't even entertain them type of battles. He said it don't make sense. That's what Smack said. Holla, that's what Smack said. We got a problem on the floor because you told the people that I hated on your punk ass 20,000 and I cost you 200,000. That's what you put out to the people. And the people was believing that bitch ass shit because you walk around and lie and you play games. And I don't. If I don't fuck with you, I tell a nigga I don't fuck with him. I ain't lying to you. You held that in for six years. That's another bitch ass trait, man. That's a that's a girl trait. That's a devil like trait. You held your feelings. You'll try to make me look like I'm the bad nigga because I'll say fuck a nigga in his presence so he won't get it mis- like c- confused that I don't fuck with him. Man. I don't rock with you like that. And it's going to be no, I ain't laughing at no niggas jokes and shit if I don't fuck with him. That's, that's more your style of play. Been lying consistently the whole time. The nigga first said, I blocked his $20,000. The nigga came at Gerald and was, y'all don't remember, he was pressing Gerald for the money. He was saying, send it, or just send it, and I just, if it don't work, I'll send it back. A rich nigga don't have to say that. He already has the money. A rich nigga would have paid himself to write if he know the money coming. So they used me as a sacrifice to, like, put it off on me because his plan didn't work. Smack, that company is Smack, Beasley, and, and Eric. I mean, Smack, Chico, and Beasley. They make decisions together. Smack said he don't entertain that shit. What the fuck was Beasley talking about then? And how the fuck is y'all talking to Beasley? And y'all told me last summer at Max Out, Beasley was behind leaking the footage and it cost us some money, right? 
All this shit don't make sense. All this shit is connected to fucking money. It's a money thing. So I said, okay, that don't. So he made a fallout with me and, and told all y'all I costed him two hundred thousand. Smack said this battle wasn't even a thought for him. Somebody's lying here, man. Or 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 maybe y'all don't hear the lie. Who's lying? Okay, with the truck situation, Holla threw dude on the. He threw his manager on uh under the bus publicly. The manager says and, and writes on his page, hey, man, I got to tell my side of that story. That ain't true. That's another nigga saying he lying on him. Tay Rock said, hey, I didn't ever say I hated him. That's another nigga who's saying that he lying on him. This cinnamon story don't make sense. It's another nigga. The cinnamon story doesn't make sense because the nigga said he said on live she was shot in the face. Bullet came out the back of her head. That doesn't make sense. It doesn't add up. She doesn't speak crazy. You haven't showed her exit wound. She had weaving on her two weeks after the shoot. She has no ball spot in the back of her head, huh? It doesn't make sense. He tells y'all, I fucked up his money, right? He got y'all thinking that this, 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 this bags and body shit is him spending his money. No, the fuck is not, and we all know that. We don't know that. That nigga ain't got one Midwest nigga on that card, man. He ain't got one. Nigga, think about where everybody's from. Where is he from? St. Louis. His opponent is from L.A. He paid New Jersey. He paid, uh, let me see, who, who is Turk Battle? Fuck. I mean, the battle ain't got no, it's no buzz on this shit. And he think it is. He tricking y'all thinking it is because he got people tweeting and the bloggers he cool with speaking on. Boy, ain't nobody even talking about this. I can't even remember who the fuck Twerk battle. And Twerk is a big name. Who the fuck does Twerk take? I should know that, man. I should be looking. Man, you out your fucking mind? Big K. Twerk Big K. Okay. Big K is RBE. Twerk is Hollis friend. Big K don't ever talk that much shit. Twerk ain't really going to say nothing and promote it. Gotti ain't going to promote it. No one cares about Swamp and his promotion don't matter. Rex is off the grid most of the time. The man is by himself. Why is J2 and 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 Snake Eyes the loudest battle with you main top tier niggas then? And they little oaks. Like not no well not not uh like that. I'm saying they go on early. But why is they the loudest thing on that card? And you big niggas ain't like, holla ain't hot as what the fuck he told y'all then. Because the world should have stopped for that nigga if the if the energy of your car that you said is so big, which is microscopic, because ain't nobody talking about it. I don't like talking about it. It don't make sense. Me, our fuel is more entertaining than your whole car coming. But I'm always more entertaining than the whole car coming, little nigga. I stop some of madness by myself and stop you too. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They're gonna slow that traffic down because you ain't got what I got, nigga. See, now, now it's on you because you got a front runner. And you don't even speak well, then. You don't even speak well. Come on, cut the shit. You make these punks afraid of you, and you know we know not to be afraid of you. Okay. You said publicly, I'm just running down everything this nigga done done. You said publicly you shot at one of my parties back in the day. How dirty is that, and you ain't even around us? You also said that you've been having feelings for six years, how dirty, and we was just all on Max out. And you didn't stand with no St. Louis niggas that night. And that's the only night we all been together, and we never not stand with each other. That's the night you chose not to stand. Your bags and body card. You didn't break bread and promote any other St. Louis niggas. And St. Louis niggas, yeah, when the ones that jump on this dick and shit, y'all don't see this? He ain't battled for neither league back home in St. Louis since he's been popped. Neither. I battle for both. Neither. But y'all fuck with it. It doesn't make sense. There's no St. Louis nigga that got to check out this. He paid every other place. He paid South Carolina, where Swamp is. And Swamp's the only person that lived there. He paid South Carolina, L.A., New Jersey, uh, New York twice. And, and he paid uh, J2. J2 is from uh, well, Indiana, but he represents Atlanta. Um, where is the, you didn't pay, Calico? All that, all that motherfucking buffing you was doing for 
uh, here, man, and he ain't, he ain't find no money for you. Calico and Swamp makes sense. And you was doing all that goddamn buffing for him, BMF. He he ain't put you shit. Something don't make sense here, man. Hmm? The the fight been Calico and Swamp. Calico's a free agent. So what what went wrong in their communication? Holly either tried to lowball you or some shit like that, and something didn't go wrong, or he didn't break the bread with you. All y'all niggas that be cock blowing, there no uh Midwest commentators or someone from our way then. Nothing, nobody, no, we going with frozen. Nigga, whose money is it? You want to tell the people who money it is and stop lying to them again? How? You cannot say a nigga holler spent some money out here on, on booking battles, but he fell out with me over 20000 that wasn't his. How? Y'all are dumb as hell, man. <laughs> he said no to the hands with me. <laughs> Look at the, all the shit he did, man. He said he wanted to shoot me. He wanted to kill me. He wanted to pop in my security. He, so he wants to smoke me, but he don't want to shoot the niggas that shot Cinnamon. Cinnamon is a black woman that took a bullet in her face for the nigga, and he ain't married her. That don't make sense either. Mm -mm. For, for, for all you niggas in the back, he tell the hoes, verb, hey, black women, I marry one, bitch. I did, she, she ain't take no bullet for me. Yours took a bullet. That doesn't make sense, Holla. It, it, nothing you do makes sense because you're stupid. It doesn't make sense. The black woman took a bullet in the this is, and, and holla. I'm beating you with your own words, you bitch ass nigga, and reading what everybody else saying about you. Holla, Rock said you lied on him. PB said you lied on him. Verb said you lied on him. Like these are people that are coming up saying, "Hey man, dude, you playing too much," and nobody questions this character. Okay. Mm. What Midwest nigga got to check out this? Look, look, look. Holla, if you were so hot, it wouldn't have been no max out with the whole St. Louis. None of us solicited our services. ARP came to me. If you was that fucking hot, he didn't need me. And if you was that mad about it, you should have told no, I don't want him over here with me. But there's no Midwest niggas on the car. Right? There's no St. Louis nigga on the card, which is dumb. That don't even fucking make sense. There's no, okay, if y'all clapping for him, like, street status, y'all could do the podcast. Why y'all can't come? Something don't make sense. Like, how, how do we clap for a nigga that's saying fuck everybody? Whenever he want to say fuck everybody, when he don't need you. Once, he, once he's done with you, you mean nothing. Holla only stays cool with people that have a lot of money that he can get it from. He won't stay cool with nobody. He spell out. Look how many groups of friends you sent them in battles with. He spell out with a ton of niggas. Man. He falls out with everybody. Currently, right now in battle rap, he's staticking with all top names behind the wall. He likes to keep it behind the wall. He likes to break alliances behind the wall. That's the type of nigga he is. And I, I'm not lying. I'm just reading. The, I'm reading the scorecard, nigga. I ain't even. Smack said he wasn't trying to book that shit, man. Now, now, who we mad at? That's what Smack said. So if Smack say he wasn't trying to do that shit, that means you started all this shit with me for no reason, which makes sense because, bitch-ass nigga, you said you felt the way for six years. That's some whole shit, nigga. That's some 100% whole shit. Then you said you shot up one of my parties on live like another dummy. Some more whole shit. Then you threatened my life. More whole shit. But you didn't, you don't want no wreck, you bitch ass nigga with the niggas who shot her. You cooperated with police with them, you bitch ass nigga. It's on file. But you want to smoke me. You kneeled and cooperated, nigga. You gave footage and statements, nigga. If you a gang member, you can't give footage. You can't make statements. You can't be cool with a Chris Unbiased and he got that shit on him about little girls. You can't be. You got 10 fake pages tweeting people. You a hoe, man. You got 10 fake pages playing. Who can stand with this type of bitch ass nigga?
What superstar buys views, holla? Cassidy said something about fighting you. You reach for a bag, you soft-ass nigga. Play, nigga, I told you don't fucking play with me because I'm going to step on you every fucking day, nigga. The same way I did that white boy. And by the time you get on stage, I promise you got it going viral. That'll be the last time you'll be worth it, nigga. I'm going to step on your bitch ass every motherfucking day, nigga, because you shouldn't have played with me, nigga. Play with them puss ass niggas, man. Play with somebody without the cardinal cap. You ain't bring no money to magic. You didn't put no money in ill hand, nigga. You ain't staying with magic. You ain't staying with ill, nigga. I stood behind all our troops and went right on stage and rap. Follow protocol around this motherfucker. KD can't get on the card and get the promotion? You brought it to J2 and, and, and Snake? You didn't put th think KD in the mix, nigga? He wore the cardinal cap, dumbass nigga. Hey, holla. If I wasn't Berg, you would have never got hurt, nigga. You don't turn your back, you bitch ass nigga. You would have never got here if I didn't rap February 28, 2009 while your puss ass is out there dribbling that ball. And we was on that corner, nigga. You didn't believe, nigga. Your bitch ass sat at school, nigga. You worked on your crossover, nigga. I was out there rapping in 10 degree weather, puss ass nigga. And you turned your back on us? But, it's, but, but when it's convenient, then it's, oh, okay, um, St. Louis, St. You ain't rap for neither league back home, nigga. I rap for both of them. You ain't put no money back. You come get money and then you walk, nigga. Your bags and bodies troops, that should be their first time experiencing that. You turned your back on them, niggas. You play with everybody. More severely, nigga, it's a black woman. You, you saw your mom and daddy be married. Your entire life, you bitch ass nigga, which is a gift. Cause see, you don't understand niggas that really come from settings when we only gotta listen to our mama. We don't have a balance, nigga. We become more erratic. Everything she feels comes on that fucking kid, you bitch ass nigga. You were saved from that. And your gal takes a bullet in the face and you don't marry her. And you saw that, you soft ass nigga. I'm stepping on you, nigga. Hey, hey, holla. When I'm done, these hoes is gonna spit in your motherfucking face, nigga. I promise you that, nigga. But you told, see, you told them hoes, I don't like black women. Hey, Holly, if I can't stand a black bitch, purple, red, orange, I will tell the color in this motherfucking face, nigga. You the one that holds feelings for six years. Tay Rock wrote that you lied on him. I didn't write that. Tay Rock wrote that. Tay Rock wrote you, you th that you lied on him. Everybody saying, everybody picking on you, dude. You ain't did shit to nobody. Kenny came on Byron Blake Page and said, holla, lie, because you told people you didn't know him. Document it, man. The, the messages is up. You said you didn't know that dude like that, and that dude was a civilian, and you picked on him, you bitch-ass nigga. That nigga said he's a fucking liar. We went to school together and everything. You a fucking liar, man. You think lying is the way to get places. It is for temporary until you fuck with a nigga like me. Because these, these internet niggas and people in this rap culture, guess what? They don't know your bitch ass. I do. That's why I'm the only nigga that scarred you on that stage and gave you that traumatizing feeling, bitch ass nigga, because I'm the only one that know you. These niggas don't know you. ARP don't know you. These niggas don't know. They don't know who the fuck you really is because you sell it good. And you hold your real feelings. Any nigga that can hold a nigga feelings in, nigga, please. You ain't putting no money in no cardinal cap hand, nigga. How the fuck you got that much power when you ain't look to say, let's get KD here or let's get BMAC here or somebody that's been rocking with you that wear that same fucking hat, you bitch ass nigga. You didn't even, you ain't even bring the money to the Midwest, nigga. You went everywhere else outside. This nigga's a hoe, man. I said, let's box. 
Absolutely not. You was a hoe, man. I'm thundering your shit, though. I promise you, little dude, every day. Look, hey, do not play no games with me, though. Nigga, you play with me like that? You know how I am, though. I'm relentless, nigga. I, any, I don't give a fuck what a nigga feel like, nigga. I'm going to keep going, nigga, because you ain't going to play with me ever, nigga. We going we gonna to stop the bullshit here, nigga. Ain't no lying on me, though. I take what I do. Ain't no lying on me, though. And because you was on, you didn't want to face who the fuck you was and that you needed some money because you was trying to press a millionaire for the fucking money. You were saying, hurry up, just sending it to me right now. That ain't no rich nigga talk, bitch ass nigga. Who you fooling? And Smack just said that he had no idea. He didn't even want to fuck with that. That's what Smack said. You going to bark on Smack? Or you going to kill the niggas that shot your gal, nigga? You ain't kill shit. You pointed your finger. But you want to smoke me? You a bitch, nigga. God wouldn't let you smoke me, nigga. You can't do nothing with me, nigga. You can't come near me, nigga. You come around playing with me, nigga. You, you the devil, boy. Everything I built, you destroyed, you bitch ass nigga. You was the first nigga who fucking mind them East Coast niggas got in. That's why I had to whoop your ass, nigga. That's why Big Bro broke your bitch ass jaw in front of our people, nigga. Everything I built, you want to tear it down. You the first nigga that got starstruck from our way, nigga. You want to be around the other niggas because you can't be a fucking star next to me, nigga. You the one that start walking across the room like somebody did something to you. Glitter louder, bitch ass nigga. You put no money in no card, no cash. Nigga, any of you soft ass St. Louis niggas that go for that nigga, take your card, your card, no cap, and throw it in the fucking grass, nigga. He ain't putting no money back. I put money back, nigga. They couldn't afford me either, nigga. I put money back, though. Didn't I, Marcus? Didn't I owe? Has Holla did that? Has Holla, with his bags and body card, has he fed one of our people? Has he gave them the promotion? He gave his money to a nigga that puts a dick in his mouth before he put it on with a nigga who wears that red cap. That's insanity. That's insanity. Bitch ass. He don't do no gangster. This nigga sacrifices his own brother in front of people. He did that in front of us, y'all. His baby brother, he sacrificed him in front of us. This nigga is the devil. He don't want to kill the niggas in L.A. that robbed him. He don't want to kill them. He don't want to kill the niggas. You don't love cinnamon then. Just tell the truth then. If you don't want to kill the niggas who shot, nigga, you think I'd be rapping if a nigga shot my bitch, nigga? You think I got time to go on stage and I know it's some niggas walking around here that shot my bitch, nigga? You know big bro gonna put that money on him and get them the fuck up out of here. That's all it's gonna be. Who is you talking to? You went right back to rap. Nigga, please. Yo, nigga, your heart ain't like mine, nigga. Because you ain't never had to risk nothing, you bitch ass nigga. Everybody gave you shit your whole life. You ain't never had to risk something. Your heart ain't like mine, nigga. That's why I said, look, if we go burn knuckle in the street, I'm going to try to kill him. I am. His heart don't, it ain't hard enough. It, it, he didn't grow up in the settings where he had to be like that, nigga. He had balance, nigga. Nigga, rage is clicking on for you. And then when you do that to Holla, he ain't going to be able to handle that. He running to get his gun. Just like he did in front of a 150-pound Cassidy. Just like it's two stories in St. Louis where niggas then stole on Holla by himself and he turned his back and ran from him. Two stories. Just like some niggas jumped Holla and he moved and packed and moved his shit up and moved out the city. You know how many times I've been jumped in St. Louis? And I was right back outside the next couple of days. What's up? I get up with them when I get up with them. That nigga took one, he took one lynching and packed up and moved. And this nigga, y'all gangster. Man, y'all gangster. Weak as a motherfucker. He could be a gangster to y'all, these niggas on the net and all that type of shit. Holla. 
by the time your battle come up, your credibility will be to the floor. There will be no energy on your battle. I shut down Summer Madness. You're not a fourth of that. You're not a fourth. And I'm, I, I ain't even went into my playbook yet. I got time, sir. But the day you the day you be done with dude, I promise you that'll be your last time doing it though. For sure. Because you're gonna you about to look crazy. They don't know how dirty you play. Anybody that joined your team and didn't you manipulate everybody, bro. You play dirty as fuck. And you know I know. Oh, y'all gonna know. When you come from them setting, nigga, you'll never be able to beat me at a bitch ass thing. Not nothing I want to do. Uh-uh. Settings don't tell you that. Settings don't tell you that, nigga. You can't punch a drunk nigga and he tells you stop playing with me. Now, now that I said, you gotta, you, you gonna punch that drunk nigga, he better go to sleep. Bitch ass nigga. Did all that shit for nothing and Smack just said that. Now watch how he responds. Watch how that bitch ass nigga responds. How, how do you, how do you clarify that you shot up one of my parties and no nobody even know what the fuck you talking about? It's like, you did some shit like that and you ain't even like how does that make you look like a child man, like a bitch ass nigga that can do shit and then roll his eyes and get quiet like a girl can you ain't feed one corn no cow nigga i fed you you bitch ass nigga i was giving you money the whole time wasn't i lying say i wasn't anytime you needed something nigga, i fed you shut your bitch ass up you ain't feed none of our people you ain't even give our people a look didn't get us a new a host or some something something that solidifies you, nigga. The West Side already saying you ain't from there, you dumbass, nigga. You see how they acting? You ain't said nothing about the West Side since then. You ain't said shit about sin. You get quiet when that pressure get on, cause you whole ass niggas in this culture, y'all don't pressure them, cause y'all punks in real life. Yeah, how you a punk in real life and a punk on a nigga? You want to kill me though? Byron puts up your. Your family business of getting sued and bills and shit, and you want to kill me. Nigga, you can't kill me, bitch ass nigga. Not your kind. I made it this long, nigga. A bitch ass nigga like you? No. No. But I promise you, you better stay away from me or I'm going to get my first kill. I promise you that, though. I wouldn't think, nigga. I know what type of nigga you is, and it's a demon on you. You the devil, nigga. The devil will lie, will steal, kill, and lie. That's what the devil does. Steal, kill, lie. Just what the devil does. He does that. And that's what this nigga does. Now, which one of you bitch ass bloggers or any of you dick pullers want to argue that? These are four people saying dude and lied on them. So we're not going to question it because y'all hoes, because y'all scared of the, uh, of the boogeyman. He ain't fucking real. I am, nigga. Yo, boogeyman's scared of me, you bitch ass niggas. He said he had to kill me. He didn't say he he punched other niggas. He said he had to kill me. That means I'm way harder than y'all, right? Yo, boogeyman scared of me, you bitch ass humans. And y'all scared of him, and you think y'all can stop me? It, it ain't been a force here that could stop me. None of you bitch niggas. Why do we have, why did he have to team up with Beasley and ARP against uh, like Verb and shit like that, and nothing changes? Because he really is that fucking nigga. That nigga threw how many attacks at me? How many people he has speak? How many? How many? Nothing. Fuck is y'all talking about, me? Nigga? nigga, I'm going to bring the worth of that event to the floor, and you don't even have no idea. Because it is. It's trash. No one's even talking about it. It, it, ha it has no steam. You big, bad holler, and that's what you brought us. Talking about the biggest card. Biggest card where? What's so big about it? It's quiet as a motherfucker. Ain't no excitement on that, nigga. When I signed up for Max Out, because y'all needed me, I didn't I didn't solicit. When y'all when I came to Max Out, everything lit up, right? Let's are, are we lying or are we gonna keep it real anywhere down the board or not? Oh, okay.